Alright, good evening everybody. Um, so today we're going to learn how to find the HCF of a number using the, um, the prime factorization method. Or the, yes, yeah, the prime factorization. So in this uh, method, you're going to take, let's see, um, two numbers, draw a line like this. Take two numbers, let's say 10 and then draw another line, 20. Yeah? Oh wait, I'm so sorry. Just take two numbers, yes, take two numbers. And then instead of doing this right over here, make another line. Yeah, okay. Now first let's do it for 10. So 10 is divisible by 2, right? So we write a 5. Now is 5 divisible by 2? No. So is it divisible by 3? No. And is it divisible by 5? Yes. So 5 and a 1. Okay. So basically 10 is equal to this multiplied by this multiplied by this. 2 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 1. Yeah. Okay, now I'm saying for 20. Is 20 divisible by 2? Yes. 10. 10? Yes. 5. 5? No. It is divisible by 5. Yeah. So 20 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 5. Okay. And now let's find the common um, factor. 2 and you've got 5 and 5. Yeah. So the HCF is equal to 2 multiplied by 5. Yeah. Which is 10. Alright. Now let's probably try another one. Uh, now we, we try 16, 14. And 12. Huh? Okay. So let's do it for 16. Divisible by 2. Divisible by 2. Divisible by 2. Divisible by 2. Yeah? And same for 14. Yes? 7. 7 is not divisible by 2, 3 or 5. But 7. Okay. 12. 2. Yes. 2. Yes. 3. Okay. So. um, 1, 6 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2. Yeah, okay, and then I'll erase 16 because it's taking a lot of space. And then, four, oh my god. Yeah, 14 is equal to, let's see, um, 2 multiplied by 7. And then, uh, 12 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by Three. Great. Now let's just find the common multiples. Let's see. Two. Um. Okay. So yes, there is no more common because it, this fourteen has a seven and none of them have a seven. So yes, the HCF is equal to two multiplied by one. Two. So yes, and that is how you find the HCF of two numbers using the prime factorization method. So I'll just write the name of the method down. The prime factorization method yeah okay guys see you later bye bye